information in a homicide case. Police say her husband shot and killed a mother of three inside their home. Good afternoon. I'm Cheryl McHenry. James Brown is off today. This happened yesterday afternoon on California Avenue in Kettering. News Center 7's Kayla McDermott joins us live now. And Kayla, this is Kettering's first homicide since 2021. And it happened right inside of this home here. And since it happened inside of the home, police, they don't have any suspects at this time. We were the only news station at the scene Tuesday afternoon as police were going into the house. Officers were tipped off about the home from the main suspect, the woman's husband. Kettering Police Department received a call from the Montgomery County Jail stating that they had an individual there uh, who stated that he had had a domestic violent incident at his residence with his wife uh, and that she was injured. When Kettering police entered the home, they quickly found the woman, but she was more than just injured. I uh, went inside and did find a female who was deceased uh, and she was shot several times. In the incident report, it states the victim was shot in both the head and in the chest. We do believe it occurred in the home. It was in a restroom in the residence. As for the victim's children. I believe there were children inside the residence when this act occurred. Kettering's chief couldn't say what led to the shooting, but in the report, it states the victim's mother was at the house when police arrived. She could not make contact with her daughter and was there to pick her up to move her out. Once finding the victim, the husband was taken into custody. He is now in the Kettering City Jail. Police did not release his name, but we checked the booking system. There are only two people in custody currently, one of which is 27-year-old Tavion Glenn, who is charged with aggravated murder. He was brought in on 330 West 2nd Street, the location of the Montgomery County Jail. Once the suspect is charged, police will identify him. And we did some digging and found out how rare homicides are here in Kettering. In an hour, I'll tell you how many there have been since 2019. And you'll also hear from a neighbor who said that he was shocked that this happened on his block. Reporting live in Kettering, Kayla McDermott, New Center 7. We'll see you at 6, Kayla.